going to quickly add um, add an asset, so our image drawables. So tools, resource manager right here, um, and then we go to drawable. At the drawable, we click on add resource to the module. We go to import mod drawables, and we go down and select our image. I have SVG images, um, and I'm going to import one. So I click on open. This is the name of the image when I imported it. I want to name that to something more relevant. So D2 makes more sense. This is Dive 2. I click on Next and I import this image. Android is going to convert it to XML for me because this is actually a vector drawable image. So I'm going to import that image. Image is available there. Uh, what I'll see now is how to actually incorporate that image into uh, my application. So I will start typing the word image. I will see that that's the image I care about, image class that I care about, and image function. I will press enter and I will get my painter resource. And my painter resource is going, going to be the thing that I, I just named this image, okay? So for me, it's going to R, which stands for resource manager, drawable, and then the name of this image, which I named to D2. For content description, I'm going to take one of the strings that I've defined here, uh, and D2 underscore description is the right one. And okay, obviously I can't just use D2 uh, description, I have to actually give it a string resource, and that string resource is going to be r.string.d2 underscore description. And so now when I go to my preview here, um i should see a rendered preview and it shows me an image and you don't see the text um and the reason why is because we don't have a column set up here right so just to illustrate that point we're going to go to start typing column this is the column we care about press enter and it'll create a column and anything in this column is going to be in the column so let's just take this and cut and paste it over here okay and just to make it look better i'm going to separate those two and i want to see what my preview looks like and so now i see the image on top and i see hello android 